Good morning, everybody. Welcome back. If you're new here, hi, I'm Mercury. Welcome to my channel. My daily vlog, so whatever I'm up to is what you're gonna see. And today is the final day of the cross-country journey. That is right. So we are leaving the Pittsburgh area of Pennsylvania and I will be home tonight, back in Jersey. So it's still a long drive. Pennsylvania is an extremely wide state. It's the longest pencil in the world. I know it's a bad joke, but it really is. And we have to get through it. So that is today's journey. Uh, last night's hotel did not have a breakfast, so we're gonna stop at the Starbucks to get the egg bites and the breakfast items. And then on we go. The map says we're gonna go over a river. See, there's a river coming up. Let's, let's check out the river. I see a bridge. pretty with like the trees on the hill behind the bridge. I like it. That's a gorgeous view. Starbucks lady gave Freya a pup cup and she is loving it. Look at this. I haven't seen her this excited since I gave her a frosty paws. She's gonna have it all over her face. Oh yes she is. <laughs> There's lots of rolling green hills in Pennsylvania. Very pretty. Daylight way in the distance there. I see daylight. I see daylight. And Wiggly Road. Daylight. No, not hello, darkness, my old friend. Daylight. <laughs> Freya. What did you think of the tunnel? Did you care about the tunnel? It woke me up, zero hours. It did wake you up, I am sorry. I'm sorry that tunnel woke you up. But look, there's pretty scenery to look at. Yep. This is a very dark, creepy tunnel. Yeah, it's like only lit on one side over here. And not at all right here. It's not even like the lights are off, they're just no lights. Whoa, dark. There were just no lights on that side. Hello, daylight. Hello, nurse. <laughs> oh, those clouds. Getting thicker and thicker. Here comes the rain. It's a bit moist out there. Or very moist out there. No, 
that I, I don't want the copyright ding, but here comes the rain down in Africa. Or, or actually in Pennsylvania. Oh, that was really off the beat. <laughs> my sister's laughing at me because she thinks I lost my marbles. Freya, on the other hand, enjoys my antics. Ooh, look at all that water. This is a big river. Not the mighty Mississippi, but it's a big river. Caliber Island right now. Just little offshoots of it. Mm -hmm. These tree floating trees. trees. Floating trees, Caliber Island. Look at that. There's also like a nuclear power plant in the distance. And a runway. So we just stopped for lunch at the King of Prussia Mall. There was a restaurant called Bar Taco, and it was so good. And and they let Freya in. So it's it's raining. It's like like you can see it's it's pretty wet and miserable out. So they weren't doing any outdoor seating. And I when I went up to the counter, I was like, we have a dog with us. Like, should we just order to go? And they were like, you can bring her in. So, you know, Freya is so well behaved. So she just sat there and they brought her a little dish of water. So Freya was, was well taken care of. And then the food was really good. So the way that you order, it's called bar taco because it's kind of like a bar in the sense of like you, you run a tab basically. And they have a barcode on each table and you scan it with your phone and you place your order and you can just sort of like order one thing at a time or you can order like everything all at once however you want to do it and they just bring stuff out as you order it and then when you're all done you just close out your tab easy peasy lemon squeezy and everything was so good but i do caution everything had a kick to it everything was kind of spicy so it's like it wasn't like hot in your mouth spicy but after you swallow and then like on the back end it was that kind of spice so I had a chicken taco, I had a falafel taco, and I had a shrimp taco, and they were all really, really good. And my sister liked her food too, so I would definitely recommend it. Freya, would you recommend it? Oof. You give it five bones? Five bones. She said five bones. Oof. So five bones would recommend, and the humans, you know, approve as well. Deal. <laughs> Coming up on that last border crossing, Pennsylvania into Jersey. Freya, would you like to give us the dog perspective of going over the Delaware River in traffic? It says, woof, traffic sucks. Woof. Is it a pup date? Yeah, <laughs> it was a pup date. Ah, I see what you did there. We are going to enter New Jersey. We are here. We are in Jersey now. There be a sign. Jersey, Pennsylvania. Yep, it was right there <laughs> on, the, on the bridge. Yeah, but like there should be a welcome to New Jersey. Maybe when we get off the bridge. There it is, the Delaware River. Welcome to Jersey. Please yes. And the turnpike with tolls. <laughs> and I am home. Finally. It's been a very long few days. So 
yeah, long, long road trip. I'm home, I'm settled, I'm safe. So after lunch, you know, we just kept on going. We were, you know, almost a big chunk of the way home. The restaurant we stopped at, Bar Taco, was in King of Prussia at this huge mall complex, but it like faced externally. And they were so awesome and they were super dog friendly and they really liked having Freya there. So it was a great place to stop. And like I said, super delicious. So I am going to unpack and relax and unwind a bit. Um, I might do a little recap tomorrow, just some of my favorite parts of the trip, some things that are worth seeing, you know, what I really liked about certain hotels, things along those lines. So I will do that tomorrow once I settle in and eat some dinner and have a chance to relax a little bit. But, you know, this wasn't a vacation. This was trying to get my sister safely home with a doggy in tow and, you know, mission accomplished. It was done. And Freya was so good. She was such a good car doggo. She was great. So I, I'm so impressed with how well she traveled. So with that, I'm gonna get going for now and I will see everybody tomorrow. And until then, stay inspired by everyone. Take care. Bye.